Hello, Professor Bright here, and welcome back to Hollow Knight, where this guy is keeping us prisoner, until we kill something for him. So that's what we're going to have to do. Also, discovered the ability to do that. And my god, am I going to be using that a lot. An irresponsible amount of times, in fact. Because, I mean, who wouldn't? Like, how could I not? The only thing holding me back is the fact that it costs soul, which is also the way I heal. So perhaps I should not use it as much as I no doubt will. But in my defense, look at that thing. It's amazing. Yeah, these little roly-poly things are no match for me. Hmm... Yep. Kinda love that ability. Not gonna lie. Ah. Well, that wasn't quite what I intended, but... That works, too. Excellent. And you must be the big guy. Ah, I see how we do this. You're one of them tutorial monsters. Trying to teach me about how the vengeful spirit works. Well, look at you. You appear to be dead for some reason. Cannot imagine why. And Soul Catcher. Got a charm. Which I need to open the charm menu while resting at a bench to use. Hello. Why is that up there, then? Well, I don't know. It doesn't matter right now. Hey! No, oh, so it's done, then. You've slain the beast. The poor thing. It must have been terrified of you. It used to be quite docile, but the rancid air in these caverns filled it with some ancient rage. Still, you did what had to be done. You have my gratitude. Of course, we both know you wouldn't have made it without that spell of mine. Oh, ho, ho. And look, the gate between us is opened. Oh, ho, ho. I'm sure you're eager to move on. Farewell and have faith. Whatever you're seeking, it will find you. Oh. Well, I'm got. You know what? Let's see what it is. Why do you hesitate? You'll get nothing more from me, I'm afraid. Though I do admire your persistence. Oh. Well. Yep, I'm out. Bye. Actually, first. Bench. Put charm on. Soul Catcher, used by shamans to draw more soul from the world around them, increases the amount of soul gained when striking an enemy with the nail. Useful, though I'll probably replace it with something more useful later. I've got money now! Well, at least a sizable amount of money. A fair amount of money. A little bit of money. And hey! You? Sorry I missed you. If you're feeling lost, why not pop up to our store in Dirtmouth and purchase a map of this area? Available now for an excellent price. Probably more expensive than the price I paid, I would assume. But I might be wrong about that. And you know what I really need to buy? The ability to find out where I am on the map. I mean, I should be just below where Cornifex was before, right? So... Yeah, because that's where the hot springs are. And this is apparently a secret I'll unlock later. Whatever's above the hot springs there. So, I'm in these corridors, and there's stuff to the bottom... Yeah, bottom right of the map. So we gotta explore. I mean, the goal for this episode is just gonna be to explore the rest of this map. And then... I don't know. Well... Actually, I do know. We're going to have to get to the next area. And I still have some knowledge of how to get there. Haven't completely forgotten everything just yet. Mind you, past the second area, I don't think I'm going to know much, if anything. But, well, that's a matter for the future. The future's problem, not mine. Mm, where am I now?
Oh, all the ghosts are this way. Good. Well, you're useless. Actually, those must be buildings then. Weird. I don't know, maybe they use those ammonite fossils in the background as building material? I don't know. I'm not sure. Hmm. Hmm, I say. Well, I must be going the right way because I'm going further to the right. And those are all the dead ends I found, and... I mean... It's cute, you have like a little Disney, like early, early Disney style animation thing going on with the little snout thing. It's kind of cute. But I gotta kill you, so sorry about this. And fire. Well, that didn't work out. Oh, well, that might have been a bad idea. Uh, whoop, no, that was not the right timing, but it worked out. Cool, killed my second boss. Though you didn't have a name as far as I could tell, so mini boss? I don't know. Oh! Well then. That was disgusting. Also, was that just a bunch of flies piloting that thing, or was it... Or am I just seeing the skull of that creature right there? Because like, either way, that's gross. Gotta say, oh! Ha 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 ha. Ah, cute. And then we walked away. Just walked away and cut a bunch of grass, then entered this place. Where the background shut down again. I mean, I'm gonna have to resolve that. Yeah. Well, what what's going on with you? Ugh, Oro, you oaf, you wield your nail like a club. Esme, how much deeper do we have to go? Oh, what? Who are you? I see, this old village. What a strange dream to have led me down here. If you hadn't found me, I don't think I would have ever woken. I'm sly. Usually I live an uneventful life up in Dirtmouth. The air in these ruins doesn't agree with me, so I'd best be getting back. If you return above, come and see me. I'd probably the friendliest face left there, and I can thank you properly for your good deed. Anything else? You're exploring then. Very brave. Plenty of courageous wanderers have been lost to the hunger of these old caverns. You have your nail, though, and I can tell just by looking that you know how to wield it. Is the fact that I'm some type of scarab beetle? Because if so, that sounds kind of racist. Not okay with that. Watch yourself, Sly. Sly the fly. Wait, is there, like, a great chunk ripped out of this building? Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Not sure. Oh, there goes those platforming skills. Come on. Get better. Do the thing. Now, where would I be... Well, that's something I probably haven't seen before. Oh, no. No. Yep, this is... Yep. Yep, this is new. Okay, new seal for me to not break. Door with an open slot. Some type of rail car. Well... I don't really have anything to my name, so... Cool, moving along. Really, that can kill you? There we go. Ha! Alright. 
that's enough backtracking for me right now. Um, hmm. Oh. Oh, come on. Not another one I can't actually save. I mean, it's fine. It's okay. It's just... Uh -huh. Hate not being able to save the little caterpillar creatures. Because they're... What just... Oh! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay. Those are spikes. The spikes, you see, are spikes. And ho, oh, hey. How you guys doing? Well, that's a problem. Um, shit, I can't afford to be hit. Okay. <laughs> Almost dead there, but I didn't die. So it's fine. Um, well, I can still heal. Oh, nope, that was completely wasted. But it worked out. Kind of. Okay, still alive, kind of, sort of, almost. Now the only thing to do is really go to the far right. Explore those options. Though first, it might be best for me to go to the top. Come on. Yeah, you're dead. Did I ever go through here? Oh, right, the darkness. Nope. And then we moved up. And to the right. Mm, the mine, right? No, but the way to the mine. So yeah, up. Up from here. Yes. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. That could have been bad. That could have been very bad. But it wasn't. It was fine. That was Quirrell still here? Quirrell, buddy, you are not here. And does this seem a little bit more damaged? I could be wrong about that. Could be I'm wrong. But I might not be. But I probably am. It's probably fine. <laughs> uh, oh, hey. Didn't notice before, but if we go back through here... There's those three little faces at the top there. On the crest. Interesting probably represents some sort of existential threat, but I'm not gonna worry about it cause I'm gonna ascend and actually spend some of these monies which are actually called Geo mm, yes <sighs> hello aww, sounds so depressed yes I'm gonna buy out your store pretty much Vendor pin sounds useful. Bench pin sounds useful. Sagway, uh, yeah, you know what? Why not? And then these two will be for later. But also, I saw I can listen to you. Ah, <sighs> Mobadis. Uh, of all the places to end up, we've picked this dreary town. I thought it a temporary stop, but then my husband became obsessed with the old ruin. Now he's spending all his time down there. He argues cartography is sound business, but other than you, who's buying? Of whom, Sanjo? You enjoying yourselves down in that ruins? At times my husband makes hollowness sound a wonder, but sometimes it seems a ghastly dangerous place. Of whom, Sanjo? And repeat. Okay. Well, bye. You seem like a nice lady. Well, hi. Your lawn 
Oh, what a turn, our shopkeeper's come home. Just wandered back in, I'd hoped for grand tales of his time below, but he seems to remember almost nothing. Maybe it was all too much for him. If you're interested in his wares, watch out. He drives a hard bargain, that one. No competition, that's the problem. It's bad for the market. Not that he's complaining. Oh, I bet he isn't. Hey, your background... Uh, I've got to resolve this later. Anyway. Ah, hello. I knew we'd meet again. How do you like my cozy little store? I've made myself pretty comfortable here, selling old trinkets to travelers like yourself. If you're planning a trip below, I have several items that may improve your chance of survival. Not that you can afford them, but you know, they exist. Let's see, max, mask shard, rather. That old thing? Merely a fragment of something larger. Still, maybe you can make some use of it. Vessel fragment, a piece of a soul vessel. Could be useful. Simple key, it's a key. Wonderful. Gathering Swarm. Did you find yourself leaving behind a lot of geos? Yes, I do. So I found a use for that. Stalwart Shell. Takes more time to recover after taking damage. Alright, not that useful. Lumafly Lantern for the dark place, I'm assuming. What's more important, a light to guide your way or a friend who will stay by your side? Why not both? Take this bright little fellow as your companion and he'll light your way through the thickest darkness. And a rancid egg. Found this under the court... Under the counter. Some creature must have laid it here while I was stuck down the ruins. I suppose you could buy it. I will miss its sour odor. Why is it orange like all the dead things I keep slashing up down in the ruins? Hmm. Well. Come on. Time to go down just a little bit longer. Now we've got three places to search. Technically, we could search other places, but I mean, we don't have access to any of the ones on the right. So we're going this way. Start from the top and make our way down. Oh, hey, the caterpillar we saved. An old caterpillar. Yay! Money. Whee. More money. Whee. I assume this is reward for saving your children. Yes. Okay, cool. I saved three of you. You want to give me something more? Maybe? Just thought. You know. Might motivate me to save the rest. Just saying. Hey, guys. I've saved lives. Let's celebrate by ending a bunch. Well, that didn't work. Did not work out as expected. Well, you look new. The Pilgrim's Way. Travelers of Hallow Nest descend through verdant wilds and fungal groves to the city at this kingdom's heart. There all wishes shall be granted, all truths revealed. So, I mean, you're clearly the way forward, but what's below it? Yes. Well, let's assume this is the last entrance. Well, that's annoying. Aha! Victory, kind of. Yep. Those refill soul. Good to me. Nope. And... Well, that was just plain stupid and clumsy on my part. But also... Can't go through there just yet. So... Going back. Oh, great. I'm gonna have to climb up. Really? Okay, good. Although this is... Hmm. 
I mean, it's beautiful in its own way. Ah. Uh, look at the greenery. Hi, friend. I remember killing you. At least someone who looked a lot like you. Not that long ago. Hey, ammo. There we go. Oh yes, look at the verdant swamp. Good. Good, this is what we all want. Ted. Yeah, why is that... There's like a buzz when I step over that. Tuh. Good. So let's do it again. Yeah, that was, uh... Embarrassing. Okay, that, uh... Yeah, that could have been bad. But yeah, this is definitely the way forward. Very, very beautiful, too. In its own way. Very colorful. Actually, just very heavily green. Detailed backgrounds? Oh. Oh, I love this game. I really do. Hmm. Well, next episode we'll explore further, but for now, thank you for your time. Hit the like, comment, and subscribe buttons below. Use them responsibly, and I'll see you all soon. Bye-bye.